Good morning guys and welcome back to another video. Today I was going to record a voiceover and I wanted to explain what I was creating but then I realised the visuals explain themselves. Basically I got this mini journal from the Your Creative Studio box and I wanted to film myself making every page from the journal. So that's what you're going to be watching today. Instead of explaining every step of the way because I'm basically collaging and watercolouring throughout this journal, I actually wanted to share a little story with you guys. So enjoy the video, I hope you get some creative ideas and a bit of inspiration from this story. I've been sitting on a carousel for the last six months, going up and down, up and down. I'm content here, it's comfortable. I know exactly what's going to happen at every turn. I enjoy the slight highs and the lows aren't too low. I know I'm in a place where dreams come true. It's a happy place of joy. People rush around on sugar highs. Yet some people stay on the one ride for a long time. I'm not the only one. I see another on the ride beside me, going around and around in the teacups, although they look miserable where they are. At least here I'm sheltered. Although I am a little envious of the people on the roller coaster, I can see them from afar. Their screams of joy beam through the theme park and I hear their laughters and roars. I do wonder what it would be like to have those extreme highs at a fast pace. I do like knowing that I'm not going to stumble off and fall. When I get off this ride, I know what to expect. I have my loved ones come on and off this ride. I'm safe on this ride, especially through unpredictable times. I can see the clouds start turning grey. I know a storm is coming. Other rides will shut. People run out of the theme park and leave. But I will always be here, going up and down, around and around. The carousel is safe, sheltered from the rain. Security and comfort is what I feel when I go around. I know what to expect. Other people are jumping from here to there. Can I get there? I know I can simply step off. That's not the issue. It's if I can ever get to that roller coaster across the other side in the carnival is where I want to be. Except, is this ride for me? As the storm starts, hail releases thunder strikes and people run. It is this unpredicted weather that make people scared and fearful that they might get struck. I know that I'm safe here, going around and around. I've seen storms roll through for months. So I enjoy being here. The highs are enough and it is beautiful where I am. I am grateful to be on such a beautiful ride. But yet, in the back of my mind, I wonder, what would it be like to zoom through the sky, high up above everyone else? The roller coaster seems like a dream. But if I come off it, I might fall. The storm is ending, the clouds start to part, and I can see a half moon in the sky. The theme park is empty now as people scurried out from the rain. It's peaceful. The lights turn on on the carousel and you can see the beautiful horses lit up. The ride comes to an end. I wonder, am I ready to jump off? It might be time to move on.
Thank you so much for listening to my story today and for watching this video. This isn't the first time that I've actually read out a story that I've written or a poem that I've written on camera. Um, I've actually made a few videos in the past where I've written stories and poems and I've actually put them on YouTube. So I'll have those videos linked in the description box below if you'd like to go check those out. Now if this story did resonate with you, please let me know in the comments. I'd like to hear um, yeah, how it did or, or where you're at in your life at the moment. Um, please share it to a friend if you think that they would like to hear it. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I'm nearly at my 25,000 goal for YouTube. I'm really excited. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.